Yo, what is up, my boys? Today we will be playing Hog Rider 2.6. Yes, indeed, Hog Rider 2.6. It's not that bad in the meta right now, so that's why I'm playing it. And also because yesterday I played the highest skill deck in Clash Royale, so I really need to compensate and play something easier to play because. Yeah, I, I just used all my skill yesterday playing in Golem and I need to play something that is a bit manageable to play. If you have any ideas for future decks I, I could, should play, let me know in the comments, obviously. I always wait for your suggestions. But for now, let's, foc let's focus on this very difficult gameplay with this very skilled deck that is 2.6. Um, just kidding, it's not difficult at all. Just cycle cards, play Hog Riders, be annoying and make your opponents quit just like that. They will hate you. Uh, if I had Hog Rider, I would have played it first play, but unfortunately I didn't have it. So yeah, we will be playing it as soon as we have it and that should work. Musketeer should be able to take care more or less of the bowler. We will even freeze it just to let the Musketeer do a better job with it without getting stunned every few seconds. Um, very nice. It still dies, but it's fine. Okay, that was annoying. Didn't really appreciate it from my opponent. And we let the big guy connect. I mean, sorry, uh, not big guy because it's a woman, but you know what I mean. Archers. Um, I mean, it's probably e on right? It has to be. I will play cannon low. I will play ice golem here. Play the hog rider. Oh, the bowler actually connects. That's hilarious. Wow. Uh, I'm a fan of that. Damn, I wish I could be the princess tower right now with all those balls on my face. Uh, yes. Let me play skeletons here. He will probably bar barrel or play whatever spell he has. I'm not quite sure. Let's see. Yep, here we go. I will play Ice Golem here. He w may go for Bowler in Prediction. He goes for Archers. Okay, even better. And then ice, uh, Bowler in the... Did they say he will play Ice Golem? Oh, man. Also, this matchup is fucking bullshit. I hate this. <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't think he Giant is a bad matchup for, for, for 2.6, but it's just so fucking annoying, man. I hate it. Oh, man. Like, shut up. And he just gets so much damage, man. <gasps> Let's take care of this. And he has Bowler Nado Cannon for my Hog Riders. Like, how am I supposed to break through? Okay, that was a good play, I think. But it doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. My god, I hate this. Play this, this. That's so obnoxious. Yeah, and we lose just like that. That's lovely. Uh, we didn't even get one Hog Rider connection during the whole game. I mean, I'm blaming it all on not having Hog Rider first play. That's why we lost before. But now we will actually do it. Why would you play Tombstone? There is no point in doing that, please. Also, that Musketeer was a complete overcommitment. I am aware of that. Uh, you don't have to specify that to me. I am completely aware of that. Uh, so, if you want to leave me tips of any kind regarding 2.6 on how to play it better, I would definitely appreciate it, but I am aware that that musket here was wrong, so you don't have to specify that specifically. Let me go for Ice Golem. Um, I will go for Hog Rider as well, just a little delayed, just to give him some elixir to get that back to his barbarians, you know. If I was quicker and not like with the reaction time of a 40 year old I could have maybe like caught those e-barbs with the fireball or something but yeah I'm just slow man I go into tank that's lovely I'd say um, <laughs> skeletons also tank up for a few hits from those little puppies and we can go for another hog rider I will not go for a prediction, just wait where he plays it, okay. That one Larry had to survive. I think that one Larry literally saved this guy from getting a hit on the tower. 
Okay, that's great. I will even play the ice golem. Um, I think it's the perfect opportunity to pressure. He has barbs in hand, but he's gonna struggle. Yeah, he goes for skelly drags in one lane. Okay, and skeletons multiply on the tower. That was a great call, man. Uh, big fan of that. Are they gonna connect on the king top? Nope. Okay, if I fireball there, man, this would have been GG already, but it's fine. Uh, still got a tower. That's something that actually didn't require a lot of skill because this deck is very not skilled at all. <laughs> That's an interesting tombstone, I would say. Let me go for this. Um, let me fireball that, he's just pissing me off, just wanna take care of it. He's gonna miner, probably? I mean, what is he, this guy doing, man? Okay, sure. Let me go for Musk. Elon Musk. <laughs> uh, let me go for Ice Golem. Skellies, okay, he's gonna spell them or something. Thing. He spirit everything and we got a win. I mean, I'm actually not that surprised. It was pretty easy considering how no skill 2.6 is. Uh, it didn't even have to sweat a, a little bit. Just one hog rider, it was Kelly's push and it's GG, man. Let's keep going. Like, it, it's just too easy, man. Like, I don't know. Why isn't everyone playing 2.6? It's such an easy deck to play. You just win. But again, I'm, I don't have Hog Rider, so we may actually lose this one. It's the same as in the first game. We lost because we didn't have Hog Rider first play. If you don't Hog Rider first play your opponent, you're doing something wrong. That's what it is. Uh, have you ever even seen a Hog, Hog, Hog Rider player not playing Hog first play? I don't think you did. They don't exist. Okay, he's playing Little Prince. Huge fan of that. I will play Hog Rider with Skellies in the other lane just to be annoying. Log here. Okay, that's great. <laughs> Musketeer survives. It's gonna get tanked by the Ice Golem for a second. And that's more than enough to get a shit ton of damage. I mean, I didn't have to fireball. I forgot I have King Tower on. That's basically the only reason I fireballed there. If I remember that my king tower is turned on by that firecracker not i mean not surprising uh, i wouldn't have fireballed it would have been more than enough just leaving it like that also if you hear me <laughs> stuff like that and sneezing and, and crap is because i have a fucking allergy issue and i've already mentioned it multiple times um in videos already like it's nothing new for most people that follow me like yeah, I mention it pretty often. Uh, my dog, again, wants to be part of the video. I guess she knows when I'm recording and on purpose, she starts making noises so that she's part of videos. Also, Hog Rider connects. Now I'm going to start making noises of excitement for that. Damn, look at that Hog Rider smashing the tower. And the Musketeer finishes it off. That's great. Cannon for the Skelly Barrel. And I think we won. There is no way this guy is getting a comeback from this situation. Uh, he tries. Not gonna work though. Uh, I mean, I will just fireball that. Log, uh, I mean, Ice Golem here just so I can keep my log for other stuff. That was not ideal. I will musketeer like that because I don't want to deal with that. Cannon. Uh, we need to fireball ASAP. We need to fireball ASAP. I mean, please don't lose, man. I, I don't want to make this any longer. I'm not good with stuff that lasts long. I, okay, I didn't miss. Uh, ice Golem here. Okay. Skeletons high. Hello, and Fireball Log, Ice Spirit, and that's GG, another win, great stuff, solid, uh, let's just keep going, man, we have nothing to lose anyways, if you see that I'm quite low, it's, I mean, I'm not trying to make excuses here, but I reached Ultimate Champion pretty early on, way before the 20 win challenge started, because I was trying to be an early season menace, and, like, I was at 
13, 1400 rating and it was still top three slash 4,000 in the world. So it was pretty difficult to play. I was also trying out decks. I didn't have Little Prince, all that crap. Um, so yeah, I'm still here because I haven't played after the 20 win challenge. I was completely exhausted. So I still need to get in the mood of playing Clash Royale to be completely honest. Uh, only recording the video because obviously, I mean, I, I, I have to basically. And yeah, I will probably get higher uh, soon. Unfortunate that this firecracker didn't die, not a fan of that. And yeah, we are here for now. Now it's not even top 10k, like I, we are completely off. It's a garbage result, I know that. But yeah, I mean, <laughs> it was way better when I reached it, I, I'm just saying. Um, now we are playing against something. My god. These dogs are making do noises that I cannot comprehend. I mean, sure, go on. Definitely not being annoying at all. Uh, while Mini Pekka smashes my Hog Rider. Let me split skeletons here. Okay, that was a good defense, I would say. Um, yeah, I'm looking at my dog right now and I'm seeing things that I would rather not see. Like, I can probably, I could tell you the image that you, you would see if you were here. Imagine two dogs. One is a man. The other didn't kite the golem because he's bad at the game. And they're making cookies together. That's more or less what it's about. Um, I think we're losing this game. I blame this on my dogs that are distracting me, okay? Do I'm not making excuses, okay? It's just very distracting, okay? Uh, how are you supposed to focus when there is crap happening everywhere? No! Fucking skeletons. Got betrayed by my own skeletons. I swear to God. Hog Rider, take it for me. Take it home. Ice Golem connects. That's the damage we needed. It's almost in fireball range. Almost. Let me go for Ice Spirit here. Okay, he's gonna play Golem or something pretty soon. Oh, he actually tries to defend, wow. Okay, I see. Skeletons OP, man. I mean, we have to Fireball now. Okay, he goes for the three crown, whatever it seems. No, please stop it. Stop it. No. That's so fucking annoying. The evil firecracker with golem. Again, I'm bl I blame this on my dogs and I'm not finishing on a, of a loss because my dogs decided that it would be a good time to make cookies together. Uh, let's go for a fifth and last game. I swear, not playing anymore with this crap. It's just too easy to use. I gotta go back to actually skill decks like Eagle and Healer because, I mean, it's not fun playing with that kind of decks. Uh, we're against Sm Smarf Gabo. So it, it's most likely a second account of somebody. I mean, unless he just decided to name himself like that for no apparent reason. Um, he is playing... Uh, I mean, I'm gonna mute him first of all. Because I am, I would be the one emoting here, out of all like. Y usually, you associate emoting with two point six people players, not two point six players being emoted by others. That's pretty annoying, man. I mean, I don't appreciate you doing that. Not at all. Like, why? Get alive. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> Royal giant, man. Fucking royal giant. Oh, yeah, that's fun. I love losing against fat Americans shooting at me from big cannons. Um, what do we do here? He's going to play Evo RG, I think. I, I was not paying too much attention to what to, to what his Evo is. I will play a defensive Hog Rider because that's the new strategies of 2023. If you didn't know, like, I mean, what are we even doing? Let me play Musketeer. 
Ice Golem. He's fireballing that fair. Uh, I will go for a Hog Rider just to tank. Go, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Uh, okay, I mean, almost. Almost is not enough, yes. But still, we almost defended our Musketeer. Um, what do we do now? Uh, again, I don't know if he has Evo RG or not. I guess he does. Let's see. Okay, he doesn't play it for now. Okay, I see. Sure. Fireball. Okay. I will play something like this. Oh, you are dead. Oh my god, you are dead. No, he's not dead. Go, go, skeletons. Please. I believe in you. Please. Please. Ugh. My god, useless bitches. Uh, we didn't achieve crap there. That's so annoying. Let me fireball like that. Maybe I can get it in the ice golem range. Crap. <gasps> We're not achieving anything. That's so sad. That's even more sad. <gasps> That's the saddest thing I've ever seen. If I've ever seen one. He actually decides to go for fireball log on the musketeer. I mean, fair enough. I can't see the health of the Royal Giant because of a fucking plus 120 text in the middle of my screen. Thank you, Supercell. Great game design. Um, how are we defending that? I mean, I will just fireball, I guess. Just take the easy way. When in doubt, fireball. <sighs> so annoying, man. Uh, I'll play Hog Rider from the back or some. I don't know what I'm doing, man. He's gonna log that. Fair enough. I mean, not surprising. Again, Fireball. Oh my god, he's playing it so passively and it's pissing me off! It's pissing me off. So much. I mean, I can't defend this. I can't. I can't. I don't have the resources required to defend this push. How am I supposed to defend an RG without anything for it? Oh my fucking god, it's Smurf Gabo. Fuck you. And this will be it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, as you, uh, Yes, 2.6 is just, as I already said, just too easy to use. I'm not even, like actually focusing on the game because it doesn't require any brain cells so i turned off my brain completely and that's why we are losing because you actually need to think when playing clash royale and playing decks like this just turn off your brain and yeah i'm definitely not making excuses but that one game i really did lose lose it because of my dogs baking stuff i swear